Lovis Corinth was a German artist who was born in 1858. He was known for his unique style that combined elements of Impressionism and Expressionism. Corinth started his artistic journey by studying in Paris and Munich. He later became a member of the Berlin Secession Group and eventually became its president, succeeding Max Liebermann. Initially, his early works followed a naturalistic approach. However, after experiencing a stroke in 1911, Corinth's artistic style began to evolve. His paintings became more expressive and vibrant, with a focus on intense colors. He created portraits, landscapes, and even biblical scenes that exuded vitality and power. Apart from his artistic achievements, Corinth's influence extended beyond his own works. He played a significant role in the development of the Expressionist movement, despite initially having reservations about it. Through his experimentation with color and expressive brushwork, Corinth contributed to the evolution of artistic styles in Germany during his time. Lovis Corinth, originally named Franz Heinrich Lewis, was born on July 21, 1858, in Tapio, Prussia. Growing up as the son of a tanner, he displayed a natural talent for drawing from a young age. In 1876, he enrolled in the Academy of Königsberg to study painting. Initially, he aspired to be a history painter, but his chief instructor, Otto Gunther, persuaded him to pursue genre painting instead. Seeking artistic inspiration, Corinth traveled to Munich in 1880, a city that rivaled Paris as the avant-garde art center in Europe at the time. There, he briefly studied under Franz von die Freger before gaining admission to the prestigious Academy of Fine Arts Munich. Under the guidance of his teacher, Ludwig von Lofts, Corinth honed his skills in carefully observing colors and values, influenced by the realism of artists like Courbet and the Barbizon School, as interpreted by Munich artists Wilhelm Liebel and Wilhelm Trubner. Corinth's artistic journey was not without interruptions. In 1891, he suffered a stroke that paralyzed his right hand, severely impacting his ability to paint. However, he persevered and relearned how to paint using his left hand. This challenging period led to a significant shift in his artistic style, as he embraced a looser brushwork and more expressive approach. Corinth's works from this period often explored psychological and emotional themes, reflecting his own struggles and experiences. Despite the setback, he continued to create prolifically and gained recognition for his unique style. Corinth's later years were marked by both personal and professional successes. He received numerous awards and honors, including being appointed a professor at the Academy of Fine Arts in Berlin. His paintings were exhibited and admired internationally, and he became a prominent figure in the German art scene. Corinth's artistic legacy extends beyond his own works, as he also influenced a generation of artists, including his son, who followed in his footsteps as a painter. Today, Corinth is remembered as a versatile and influential artist who defied adversity and left a lasting impact on the art world. In conclusion, Lovis Corinth was a German artist who left an indelible mark on the art world. His unique style, combining elements of Impressionism and Expressionism, showcased his versatility and creativity. Despite facing a significant setback with a stroke that paralyzed his right hand, Corinth adapted and embraced a looser brushwork and more expressive approach, resulting in powerful and emotionally charged paintings. His influence extended beyond his own works, as he played a significant role in the development of the Expressionist movement in Germany. Corinth's ability to overcome adversity and leave a lasting impact on the art world makes him a truly remarkable artist.